How are you doing, man? How's it going, gentlemen? Good, good. See? There's a lot of technical organization going on here and the uncorked crew. So the camera's rolling. How's it going? It's going awesome. Good. It's camera uncorked. Have you, have you recovered? I, I, there's no recovery. May the 15th is all about recovery. <laughs> awesome. What are we getting this afternoon here? This is the wine festival. So we have 24 different wine vendors here, and each of them is serving somewhere between four and eight wines. Good. Well, I'm not sure if you noticed, but I got a new hat. No, I didn't see that. That's Very a, nice. This is, this is our smart hat. They call it the cattle buyer's hat. So yeah. when you have to dress up, that's the way we go. It's not much of a stretch to see an Afrikaner in a cowboy hat. It's not much of a stretch because we tend to travel quite a bit. Yes, you do. It's a wine festival walk. This is Santa de Casa. It's from the Douro region, which is the northern part of uh, Portugal. So it pairs very well with fish. So fish like this? No. No, no it's fish. <laughs> this is Alberta wine. Absolutely. All this fruit is grown in Alberta, and it's all made on our farm east of Calgary. Really? Really. It's not a liqueur. No. This is no, really it's just fermented fruity. in exactly the same way as a grape. Yes. Yes. You didn't know this. Alberta makes wine. If you look around the room, you'll see this is predominantly a female-dominated event. Mm, what did they here. do to get you two gentlemen to come here this it's afternoon? It's predominantly females here, the odds. so we came. Look around. <laughs> That's why we came. <laughs> We've got a Merlot, a Sauvignon Blanc, a Cabernet Sauvignon, and a Carmenere. I'd love the Carmenere. Where's the Malbec? I don't have a Malbec. This is from Chile, not Argentina. We know great, semi-sweet, so let's see. So it's all that bright fruit, it's got layers of spice, but all the sprite acidity balances it out. So kind of wine you can take to any party, everybody's going to like that. It is a nice Even wine. Even a red wine drinker's going to like You're that. not going to get into trouble for this one, but I need yeah. a little bit more. It needs a bit more yeah. body. It needs okay, a bit more yeah, body. Yeah, yeah. So all of our wines are coming from one of our six vineyards. All throughout the Okanagan Valley, down by Oliver, and then we have the Vanessa Vineyard, which is where our Cab Merlot is found. It is a very big, bold red meat wine, so it's nice that you call them cowboy. I think that fits perfectly in your repertoire. I would expect a little more bouquet here. You find it a little muted? It's a little bit muted, okay. and I do that with a Merlot. It tends to tone it down, but let's give it a go. You have loud packaging, you must be prepared to be on camera for okay, that. Okay, awesome. You've yeah. got a relaxed brand, what does that mean? The packaging says it all. It's just one of those easy drinking, goes down nice, inexpensive wines. And it, one big gulp. <laughs> one big gulp. Hey, which ones have you had so far? Well, first of all, we need to know who you are. We're the two cowboys. The two cowboys. And the camera. The, camera, the camera is just... just no, a, but are you filming who are you filming for? For us. And, and what do you do with the footage? We're putting it online. Oh. We're making you famous. So we've got some Okanagan ones. We've had a Pinot Gris even from Germany out there. So which one's your favorite so far? So Wait. far the Okanagan. Okanagan. Thank you. Thanks. Where are you going to put that? Where are you going to put that? I'm going to put it online and make you famous. Awesome, man. Cheers. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you. Thanks for being in Canmore. Thank you. You locals? No. Nope. No? Calgary? Wine Diva's weekend. Wine Diva weekend. There you go. That's the way to do it. Bottoms up. Is that a good mailbag? That is a fantastic mailbag. That's a Wine Spectator Top 100 Best Buy for 2016 from Amalea, which means hope for a miracle. Uh, the Amalea Melbeck is from Salta province. It's Melbeck with a touch of Tanat and Syrah. 25% of it's sun and oaks. It's not overly oaks. It's a very finesse Melbeck. Can you repeat all of that for me quickly again? <laughs> <laughs> I got the spiel down, don't I? You got the spiel down. <laughs> After a long day at the wine festival, look at this. People have to build some stamina. They have to reset. That's why we got some great chairs for you. The Cape Sun brand was built to they mix it sell up. into China. So once the reserve has been taken care of, 
whatever is left, they sort of mix it up, they put it in here, send it to China? No, they're, uh, these, the Chinese want to buy the best. And so <laughs> this wine was selected by the Calgary Stampede and they're bringing the winemaker over to present this wine. The it's best thing about a South African Cabernet is this is tobacco, earth, old leather, frankness, All you need now is a good steak. That's it. Now this is fabulous water, but it's an excellent vintage. It's Canmore tap water, and that's possibly the best in the world. We've had a few events. Things have been heating up. Lots of people around. What What do you think? What What's your highlight the so far? Festival has been great so far. Highlight so far has definitely been the long table dinner. Yeah. It didn't hurt that we had by far and away the best weather day of the entire year. Are you taking your vitamins and your energy drinks? I am, yep. And I'm going to set. We got a couple of nice little juice bars in town as well that uh, help you first thing in the, the morning. A wheat grass shot at tonic. Great way to start the day. Awesome. Good. We'll check in with you for the next one tomorrow morning. Absolutely.